Bertolt Brecht's Galileo, starring that fiddler on the roof man, Topol, and a brilliant galaxy of stars. Everything is called in doubt today. Everybody at last wants to know why is this, how's that? That's what the books say, but let's see for ourselves. <laughs> Sit down. Where's the sun? On your right or on your left? On my left. And how could it get to the right? Oh, well, you're putting it there, of course. Of course. Now, where's the sun? On my right. And did it move? No, I did. Wrong, stupid. The chair moved. But I was on it. Of course. The chair is the earth, and you are sitting on it. What do you think is going to happen to you when you say that this earth is a planet and not the center of the universe? Is there anything in the world that people won't believe? I hear this Mr. Galilei transfers mankind from the center of the universe to somewhere in the outskirts. I predict the sons of fishwives will go to school and they'll learn that the earth rolls around the sun and that the pope, the cardinals, and the princes are rolling with it. Well, I won't have it. I won't be a nobody on, on, on some nondescript star. Hurry, hurry, hurry! Presenting Galileo's phenomenon, the earth turning around the sun! The extraordinary theatrical vision of Bertolt Brecht, who delighted the world with the three-penny opera, the artistry of director Joseph Losey, Together, they create a film experience like no other. Ladies and gentlemen, where is all this leading? Your Highness, the moons of Jupiter have never been seen before, and yet they exist. The man in the street may conclude that a good many other things may exist if only he opens his eyes. Tonight, the Holy Office has decided that the theory of Copernicus, according to which the Earth moves around the sun, is false, absurd, and heretical. I am charged, Mr. Galilei, to admonish you to relinquish this opinion. I don't see how you can afford to be silent any longer. I can't afford to be roasted on a wood fire like a ham. The worst of it is, when I find something out, I have to tell others about it. Was a Benedictus for two years two years of Dominus Tecum Benedictus two years of Dominus Tecum Benedictus She is praying that he will recant. Up stood the learned Galileo, glanced briefly at the sun, and said, Almighty God was wrong in. Genesis chapter one! Unhappy is the land that has no heroes. Incorrect. Unhappy is the land that needs a hero. An independent spirit spreads like bad diseases. Still it feels good just for a change to do. Just as one pleases. As one pleases. As one Bertolt Brecht's Galileo, a richly rewarding movie in the words of Seventeen magazine. The Saturday Review says Galileo is a distinguished piece of work. Galileo, the next in a series of five great films from great plays.